morning guys. We are headed about 13.8 miles today to mile, I think it's 145, Mary's Oasis. And that's the next water. So, I mean, there are some possible water options between here and there that from the comments in the app seem questionable and not easy to get to so um, my goal is to just kind of pound out this close to 14 miles with the water I've got and then drink up when I get to Mary's Oasis um, battery power is running a little low today I was trying to charge this phone from my other phone and it went the other way and so I haven't figured that out but I've got a lot less battery power than normal starting the day about 60% of normal so I'm going to film less today and uh, unless it's uh, you know just too cool to pass up then I'll then We'll catch you up on some of the mileage, but otherwise I'm just gonna crank this out. So catch you later. Check this tree out. <clears throat> some type of cedar, I presume. Its bark is brittle. Might make a tender but not good bird's nest. Maybe on the outside of the nest. Needles. It looks like it's like some kind of cedar slash juniper, but not the junipers I'm familiar with. We're about 6.9 miles away from Mary's Oasis, or make it 13.8 for the day, and then I have to go beyond that to find a camping spot. So keep on keeping on. This is a cottonwood tree. You can tell they have these heart shaped leaves, and um, usually really thick, deep bark. What's uh, awesome about the cottonwood tree is this cambium layer that you see right here. This is amazing for catching a spark and putting into a bird's nest. You can also use the cottonwood, like here's a, here's a limb down here that fell off. So you can find you can peel that bark back, find more cambium layer, or a couple straight branches. Uh, cottonwood on cottonwood is good for a friction fire. All right, I'm hitting 13.8 miles and coming into uh, Mary's Oasis. Uh, I think that's right down here. Is this still here? Hey guys, it's um, the night of the 13th day out on trail, and 
went 14.8 miles today and tomorrow I'm gonna get up and hike down into Pioneer Valley Cafe which is just like five and a half miles away and get my box that I have there perhaps get something to eat and perhaps consider um, going into Idlewild I need to I need to do some shopping and do some town stuff tomorrow so it'll be uh, probably a Nero tomorrow but uh, we'll we'll talk to you in the morning have a good one